Hello sister log sisters. Hi, I'm coming to you from my car. My daughter's at a tutor instead of going home. I'm sitting in a car making a video for you guys. Yay. Um, anyway, I wanted to have a little chat with you about pet peeve. Sister locks are my pet peeve. My sister lock pet peeve. What are they? Right. It for me is literally lint. Oh my gosh. I can't tell you just how much I despise lint and build up in a hair literally that is one thing I do not like I do not gel with um, when necessary I literally take a tweezer if I see a lint I'll take a tweezer and pluck it out now here's the thing so right now we're heading on to winter and you know you got those fluffy jumpers fuzzy clothing um, we have all of them and they look so nice and sometimes I'm so tempted to get it and I'm like yeah that's the enemy of sister locks but I also find that it also depends on the type of hair texture you have so my daughter she has got really loose curls um, I think you might even describe her hair maybe to be 3A uh, in terms of texture and I noticed that things like um, um, it doesn't stick to her hair so much for example like a fluffy from jumpers they don't stick to her hair whereas my hair things like fluffy scarf fluffy jumpers they stick to um, so that's one thing I've noticed uh, I guess it also depends on the type of texture so my hair is what's classified as 4C but I call mine 4Z because when it's short it literally goes into like little tiny peppercorns um, so that's what I find it to be um, but yeah, I don't know what you guys' pet peeves are. So for me, for the longest, it's always been lint and build up. I don't have neither of those in my hair. I would literally cut off a lock if I cannot get rid of the um, the lint, if it's really embedded. And you're more likely to find the, uh, the embedded uh, lint in the back, uh, the back locks, uh, particularly around here. That's where you're likely to find them. Um, so for now I don't have them so if I come in closer you can see my hair is pretty clear from the roots all the way down you're not gonna find lint or you're not gonna find build up now obviously lint is caused by different things build up is caused by different things either way when you've got too much of it it looks unsightly um, for me anyways I know some people don't mind um, but I, I've never liked it from day one that's been one of my pet peeves for having sister locks. So I don't know, what are you guys' pet peeve about having sister locks? For me, is that. Um, but yeah, so far so good. I've had my sister locks for well over 10 years. And um, yeah. At the worst, oh, actually, there is another thing that tends to happen when you first get sister locks, which at the beginning, or it can still happen now, where you get the little tiny follicles. Maybe you might notice that after retightening, you get the little tiny follicles um, and they look a little white dots on a base. Now, when that used to happen to me a long time ago, I ended up dyeing my hair black because if you dye them any other color, you're still going to see them. The best way to obliterate them is to literally dye your hair black. Now, I didn't use a permanent color, it was one of these. Um, it was called Bijen and it's, a, it's like a Chinese powder and I put it to make sure your hair really dark and it also colors those little hair follicles um, so that's what I tend to use um, I haven't used one in a while so yeah but anyway let me know do you guys struggle with lint or do you struggle with build up um, I said for me with the build up again two different causes normally it's caused up by maybe grease products in the hair I don't use any product in my hair other than when I'm going in a sauna and a steam but I tend to wash it out I don't tend to put any product so I have my hair looks like this there's zero oils there's zero conditioner there's zero spray however I was in a sauna earlier and I did little rosemary oil on the edges you know you go have to get those edges in winter is approaching um, you have to look about the internal <laughs> intake as well as the external but yeah, this is where we are. Um, but let me know, uh, with your lint situation or your build up. Build up, it can easily be resolved. Some people use vinegar, um, apple cider vinegar, mix it with other stuff to get to melt it off. But again, I've never had build up um, at all. It's not, yeah, me, we just don't get, get on well together. So <laughs> um, yeah, but I understand. If you've got naturally greasy hair, 
you're gonna find you're gonna have more build up um, than normal and actually if your hair texture is quite loose curls you might not have the opportunity to wash it as often whereas mine was so my hair is so uh, very 4c as I call it said that you locked very quickly within three months of me having my hair done it was literally locked so I was able to wash it slightly more freely than to braid and band for quite some time anyway guys thank you so much for tuning in I didn't want to waffle for the for five minutes but do let me know and what is your solution other people might find it helpful in terms of getting a build up uh, by all means all right bye